Hey everyone, Matt here from Docs Running, and today we're gonna to do a sub two of the 361 Centauri. This is a completely new shoe for 361, debuting a totally new direction for the company, which I am very excited for because it's comfortable. It's actually a comfortable shoe, and that sounds mean, but they are doing a lot of great things with this shoe. So what is it, first of all? It's a training shoe, a slightly lighter training shoe, but more on that training shoe side. It's got a new foam, which allows it to handle a little bit of performance, but slightly lighter coming in at 9.8 ounces for men's size nine, 8.0 ounces for women size 8. There's a 9 millimeter drop, 31 on the heel, 22 in the forefoot. Totally new midsole, new upper design. So let's start with the top because that was the biggest surprise for me is that 361 shoes have always felt fit very narrow and like tapered in the toe box, uncomfortably so for me, even when I've gotten the wide versions. This is the first shoe, not the first one, the Flame actually fit fairly wide, but this is the first training shoe for them that fit comfortably. In fact, actually the forefoot is actually really wide and there's a lot of volume here and the same thing in midfoot. Heels fairly normal, but there's a lot of volume here. So people that need kind of a nine millimeter drop and having a wider toe box that's not super clown shaped, this is actually a great option. I'm getting a little sliding, so you might want to lock this down with the laces, but haven't had any heel slippage, which is nice. So light upper, comfortable. And then again, sole, it's this new Engage foam, whatever this is, they call it TPE, which if you've watched our previous episodes, you know that's what most things are. But it doesn't feel like pure EVA. It's got a little bit of comfortable bounce to it. It doesn't feel like that really firm ride that a lot of 361 shoes have. Yes, there is a heel bevel here, which is great. Finally, good to see that from 361. It's still small, so the heel's a little clunky initially for the first few miles. So those that land farther forward, you're gonna love this because I almost immediately got up on my forefoot, felt very comfortable, but the heel does break in, the foam does break in. It's just got a little extra posterior flare. So those people that kind of like landing a little farther forward, wanted a little newer cushioning, a little wider fit up here, you might actually like this shoe because I'm actually enjoying it. 